Oh my god, this one booted up instantly. Hi, welcome back to Mom, Can I Have Another Dollar? We're playing Galaga88, a special request from a special guy, Fred M. Sloniker of the Something Awful Forums. Mm-hmm, Fred so, M. Sloniker seems to request everything. I've never played this version, and I knew you were going to get on poor old Fred M. Sloniker's <laughs> shit. Hey, why don't you shut the fuck up and start? You're an ingrate. This what? looks like the thing that's in the title card for me, me Just seek, sim, me destroy. What are you doing? Shut up and start. Uh, fucking, I got two quarters. We're gonna do a head head, and I'm going to play and get a high score. And Kyle's gonna try to beat it with only fifty cents to a stupid name. <laughs> and I don't know. I've never played this. I don't know how different it is, if at all, from regular old Galaga. Wow, seems like it's way cooler than regular Galaga. Dimension One, Stage we, One. We tried playing regular Galaga earlier, but it was exactly like Phoenix, almost too like. It wasn't. Yeah, only a only a chump would. This is. We start with two ships, and these aliens are different colors, and I, fucking. I enjoy this. It's, it's like it's Fred colorful. I'm, it's funny because Fred and Slaughter also requested uh, Blasteroids, oh, shit. which oh was basically like a modern version, or like not a modern, but like a updated version of Asteroids. So it's a postmodern version of Asteroids. So this is kind of like a uh, just a remake. Of it just kept deconstructing the themes and tropes that it relied on. What Ooh, the I hell was the uh, the the horizontal shooter that I played on my Game Boy? Because I could have sworn it was. <laughs> no, I thought it was. Yeah. Like, I thought it was Galaga for some reason, but then like now I'm seeing this and it's like this is clearly, clearly not. The same thing. Clearly not. Although I did have a friend who owned. Oh Jesus. <laughs> Um, no, he owned a, he owned like a, one of those LED version games of Galaga. You know what I mean? Um, for what? No, no, like an LED, a self-contained little portable. You mm. know, kind of like a Game and Watch, but no, but it was better. That's Galactic Dancing. Because it was actually okay. I'll take your word for it. <laughs> that's what it said. Am I in trouble? <laughs> <laughs> I know. Uh, that's Galactic Dancing. That's a three hundred dollar fine. <laughs> that's part of space. Don't you, you know? You this need is, a permit. This is Dirty Dancing, uh, space. You fucking. You think you can just go galactic dancing without a fucking space permit? Are these just... <laughs> these this, is are, a bon this is a bonus why round. Why are these aliens flying right up to you and then just circling? It's a bonus round. What, you, you never played Galaga before? Oh, no. I, I thought I did, but then apparently I hadn't. Apparently. No. You didn't even know the difference between Galaga and fucking Phoenix. Yeah, I'm saying that... Fucking I didn't say that they're the same game. I'm saying they're very similar. Awfully similar, as a matter of fact. You know this what This is kind of like... Uh, oh, what? What's it called? This is... What? <laughs> what? What did I miss and what did I run into? You uh, got hit by an alien, and this looks a lot like uh, what's that game? What's, oh, what's Phoenix? The... No, that game where you, uh, you know the the alien game where they're constantly coming down. Galaga. Uh... <laughs> I mean, like you're no no fucking it's Ikaruga. Like, no, I don't have any ships God left. Damn so I'm not gonna what let is it that steal game me. called? Everybody, like Dude. someone's screaming at the screen right now. Oh, fucking no, you just died. Um, space Invaders. Yes, Space Invaders. Oh, is that serious? I was being sarcastic. Yeah, that's what it made me think. That was a smart-ass joke. They had the whole thing up there. Whoa. All right, so it's my turn now. Put in your fucking The fuck name. it is. I have a quarter left. Do you? Yeah, man. How do you Two know? Two quarters each. I thought I used all your quarters at once. Nope. What are you putting in, F? F. That way we know who I am. Okay. Keep in mind. Yeah. He oh, you got one be, quarter left. Yeah, it's up he to you. He has to beat F's score at the very least. Yeah, I guess so. Ah, oh, okay, select your... Oh, I can start with dual or one. I'm going to start with one this time. See if ah. that avails me. I did not realize. It gives you a little option. That's little option. Neat. Very neat. It doesn't give that? you the option. Is that supposed to be you? No, that's one of the Galagas. <laughs> oh. Bro, don't question the Galaga god. Shit. The god. <laughs> that's me, by the way. Yeah. I really hope that like I just go in here and then I just Sonic the Hedgehog this up. or uh, Sega Sonic the Se Hedgehog. Yeah, we all know what I meant. All no, Sonics. Didn't. We knew that we were, I'm good at all Sonics now. We psych, Sonic something up sounds like a good way to say fuck it up. Like, <laughs> oh, you really you really Sonic that up. It, it makes sense given you know the fact that uh, Sonic Team is the worst company in the world now. Ah, yeah. oh, boy. They yeah, Sonic Boom. I, I Sonic I, 06. Everybody mentions Sonic Boom, but I've never once even heard of that game. How? Okay, let me um let me just let me just start with that. Let me just explain. Okay. You said everyone mentions it, and yeah. you've never heard of it. Like, okay, people say Sonic Boom is the worst game, and then I've never seen or looked at any sort of material that proves that it really exists. Well, fucking. And then when I looked up Sonic Boom, it just was. It said that it was a convention, a Sonic convention. That's well. I'm so sure I was it just like, are, are they saying that the conventions suck dick? 
I don't understand. It's also the theme song to the American version of Sonic the Hedgehog CD, but you don't see anyone complaining about that. I, no, because no one played that. Yeah, well, I mean, that's because it was on the Sega CD. But no, mm-hmm. Sonic Boom was like a reboot that they released a couple years ago, and the Game Grumps did a Let's Play of it, so you should watch that and get educated. Oh, man, are we really putting uh, putting other people's Let's Plays out there for them? We fucking... Like, the Game Grumps need fucking any help. You mentioned Ropaz yesterday, and his videos get 9 trillion views <laughs> a second. Yeah, I was just saying that there are all these, these Let's Players from uh, Sweden. I'm saying you don't even know what the hell Sonic Boom is. Yeah, I know. It's actually I do know what a Sonic Boom is. It's whenever a, something breaks the the sound barrier, like I just did, motherfucker. Bam! I guess you did. I, I broke the light barrier. That's why I escaped <laughs> my event horizon. All right, I, I think, think. What What do you think? I was gonna say like if you broke the sound, like the light barrier, like Ooh, your that. ship Whoops. should just basically fall apart and you just die. You would melt. Not if you are. Or you just turn to jello. I'm not warp sure. Field. In a warp field. Yeah, man. Like That's in Star not, Trek. Oh, okay. I guess it, we can use not real science. It's where they bend space time around the ship so oh. that they move at a relatively slow speed. But space but, moves faster around them. But they can, well, sort of, they warp space around them. Gotcha. I was going to say, uh, Futurama did a similar bit, like where they're talking about how the ship moves. Well, no, it's like if you're on a blanket and then you like punch the blanket down below you and you end up on a different part of the blanket than you were <laughs> at the beginning. You know what, what? I mean? No. That didn't make any sense. Just make it... If it try to Back me up here, people. Try to visualize. I'm trying to explain... <laughs> damn, fuck. Quantum <laughs> physics. I'm trying to do... I'm trying to, like... Wait, wait, a you lot have a of, bomb. Use your bomb. Do I? Yeah, use it. I press press a, button. Press bomb button. This isn't the time for experimentation. <laughs> Why Whoa. not? I don't know what those ice shields do. Do they crash into it if I leave them up? I don't think Maybe so. Maybe I should have left them up. Oh, well, I guess you'll never find out because you're about to die. Am I now? Yes. Oh, what's this? This is new. Yeah, that's what you die on. I fucking survived oh, God. it aptly. See, you died. Titties. Told you you were going to die. Well, you All have right. 30 Jesels, bro. Hand that shit later. over and I'll... Hand it gotta, over, dude. I got to demarcate my fucking score God here. God damn it. All I right. am not making this two episodes, so you better hand that shit over. I am... Well, well, whatever, you know. I got two distinctive names. Hand this to me. Now it's your All turn. Right, here we go. Now to watch you fail. Yeah, I hope I do. Oh, shit. You got you got three minutes, and I doubt you'll use them all. Yeah. All I have to do is if I beat your score, uh, then I'm fine with that. God. It's Saturday night, and I'm here recording a Let's Play of Galaga 88s yeah. at the home of Kyle Cawthon. Oh, don't I... put my name out there. <laughs> yeah, whatever. You're the editor. You can fucking bleep it out. <laughs> yeah, fucking, I guess so. You know, and uh, fucking, you're trying to be internet famous. They're gonna know everything about you. Not all of us can be named things. Keith Richards, where we're Google proof. <laughs> that one looks like a fucking tick. Yeah, it and then it turned into tadpoles. Yeah, kind of so. Anyways, um, th- this space station here, right? It looks like. It looks like that. Here's what I was trying to say before you fucking cut me off, you cocksuck. Uh-huh. It looks like the gambling casino in Cowboy Bebop. Oh, okay. I guess. You agree? I... Agree or disagree? Don't recall Cowboy Bebop that well. Whoa, man. You are just not the cultural bellwether. I remember that episode where uh, they had the turkey that went bad. Shit. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Toys in the Attic. Is that what it's called? Toys in the Attic. And then, uh... Wow, this is... Oh, man, I am doing very poorly. Yeah, that's why I went first. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah. Fuck. You ain't got this what This ain't gonna last very long. I think we, uh... I think we <laughs> got Shit. our conclusion here. We figured out. No, no, up. no. I was just... I was just no, no, no. Up, I mean, it's a foregone conclusion is no, all I'm I was getting. No, I'm just warming up, man. Up. I don't know what the dimensions are talking about in this game. Those are the levels, I bet. Oh, shit. I didn't I mean, mean to pick the goddamn duel. <laughs> duel is, uh, the movie... What? It was it was a movie about uh, a man in a car versus a man in a truck, and it's like the spiritual precursor to Jaws. Or oh, Fast and the Furious. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Is this a real thing you're talking about, or are you just saying what? things? I don't know. Who fucking what? <laughs> Kyle? <laughs> you... Everybody. Everybody listening, <laughs> isolate that sound clip and then fucking uh, uh, bronze it. Bronze it on my wall. Oh, shit. Put it under exhibit A for Kyle is a fuckhead. 
<laughs> Kyle, God, no, Kyle. Kyle, well, what? It makes you wonder, am I saying these things because I truly am dumb, or am I trying to get a rise out of Keith to make this show more entertaining? I'm not even saying dumb, I'm we'll just saying know. a gormless fucker. Gormless fucker. No, duel's a movie. A duel, like, in, as in a duel? Yeah. Between oh. two people, a duel? Oh, okay, I get it, like a duel. Well, actually, I think it's more like duel as in duel... Like two people. Duel layer. Or is it like... A dual channel. Duel. That's galactic dancing. Oh, you're getting sent to the pokey too, eh? Yeah, I guess so. Anyways, no, it's... This guy gets chased... This guy pisses off a trucker someplace in the desert, and the truck spends like nine hours chasing him, trying to kill him. And then, uh, in the end... Uh, spoilers, so mute until the time that's on your screen right now if you don't want the movie spoiled. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna say don't mute this. <laughs> um, the guy tricks the trucker into ramming off a cliff and he crashes to his death. So what am I supposed to do when I didn't want you to tell me the spoiler to it? Um, you are supposed to have just plugged your ears and turned off your mic. I was fucking playing! Turn off your headphone. I'm not wearing headphones! I'm fucking... Oh, I thought you were. How no. are you hearing my mic so clearly? How do you? I'm, how are you checking the sound? I'm not. We've had a litany of sound issues this this session, and fucking Kyle has done nothing to ameliorate them. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I have. I mean, to prevent them in the future. But anyways, no, no, it's like I I also just like the idea that I just instantly gave you more work to do. It's pretty cool. <laughs> yeah. I told you to bleep stuff. I told you to take out stuff, and you yeah. know, fucking put stuff on the screen. Oh and put shit, fighter! Oh wait, wait, wait! He t he warned me of this. Yeah, if you have another fighter, you, you could rescue that one and get two ships at once. Oh, but you didn't, man. and I think it looks like I categorically won. Yeah, I guess so. Well, so... that concludes Galaga 88. Thank you, Fred M. Sonicer, for the recommendation. Oh, I guys... don't know why there's a Nazi SS symbol on the logo. I think it's just a lightning bolt. That's, yeah, never mind. Anyway, join us next time on Mom Kingdom of the Dollar, where we hopefully play something that you enjoy. 30 Jeezels. I won. Bye-bye. I won. Bye. I won. Man, it's a beautiful day out, and I'm stuck in here recording outros for our stupid YouTube thing. I mean, you better just, I don't know, like and subscribe so I can go home already. I mean, really? Come on.